you, my love. Sorry, sorry. Show. Uh, thank you for being here. <laughs> I'm trying to get like, well, one, we have limited pickles. So I was trying to rush around and trying to think if I should go to the store or send Joe to the store or whatever, because I like my tuna fish with pickles. Um, but anyways, we don't have the pickles. So we have Joe's homemade cucumbers. Ah! It's apparently leaking. Oh, Lord. Hold up, y'all. Gross. Well, I did. I thought it, it is tight. It is tight, but apparently not. It's probably on there. Crooked. Yeah. Hold on one second. Let me. It's gonna be hard to take yep. It I probably won't be. Able... It's leaking, yet it won't keep the juice in it. <laughs> Let me just hand you the whole. Right. Okay, guys. We are doing a pate melt. Bird's bunch. Bell belt. Welcome. Good evening. Good day. All. We are making a patty melt. All of the drama stuff that's been going around in your head and going on out there. Just leave it right at the doormat. Kick your shoes off and relax because we do want a patty melt. And I don't even like a patty melt, but I'm willing to make them for my husband. And there's another thing I don't like that I make for him. It's like a ham spread. Um, um, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna hold my composure as I describe it. I don't eat patty melts, but my husband loves patty melts. It, no, 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 I don't mind patty melts. Tuna melts, I'm not a fan of. Um, thank you, baby. Um, I don't like tuna melts or this stuff. It's called ham spread. I'm sure a lot of people eat it. You buy it in the deli section. Up in the Midwest, every time you go to the deli section, they have, what's it called, that spaghetti? Um, spaghetti salad. Spaghetti salad. And it's literally spaghetti, like stringy noodles. Italian dressing. Oh, it is? Yeah, I thought it had Italian, a... But then it's got salsa in it. Shut up. It's got Italian dressing, but also, hey, likes for days. I know that's a good wife. Girl, that's what I'm saying. It's Italian dressing and salsa. So there's like, it looks like salsa with noodles, but Joe loves it. I, I haven't figured out the recipe for that because I want it to be like that. Well, this one, I did look up the recipe and it's called um, ham, ham, ham witch or ham what? Ham salad. Like the ham, it's a, just a ham salad. I think it's just called ham salad. But I looked up the recipe and you get ham like ham in a packet, and you dice it up really small, like mince it up. Not Black Forest ham, just ham. Like real, real ham. Real ham, it has to be real ham. And it's gotta be mayo, real mayo, not Miracle Whip, and sweet pickle relish. Mm. Yeah, he loves it. But they sell it like $5.99 a pound in the store. So you buy a little packet like that, the little deli container, and it's like six twenty nine because they always go over, and I'm like, bro, it just I make. I think it's more that it smells like. It smells unsavory, but Joe eats it and he loves it. And then I'm like, go brush your teeth. I can't. Like it's almost like an olives thing for me. Like if he eats olives or he loves uh, what's that thing you eat? Um, the fish on pizza. Uh, anchovies. He eats anchovies on his pizza. And of course, while we were dating, I was a good little wife and I headed out to grab a pizza and I asked for a side of anchovies because I surely am not going to put that on my damn pizza. But I got the anchovies and I brought them home and I'll be doggone you guys if Joe ate the anchovies on his pizza. He diced up the little fishes. He said you don't really know what it tastes salty. Well, this ham sandwich or ham salad or whatever he calls it, it's like... Well, first of all, I don't like um, I don't like sweet relish. So when I'm making it for him, I was like, I can't even taste it. So then I'm like <laughs> mixing it up, and then I put it on a bread, and I was like, What do you think? And he goes, He goes, Oh, that. T well, I didn't make it in front of him. I made it on the DL. So then I handed it to him, and I made it the whole sandwich. And he goes, Oh, good, you bought some. And I was like, That means I did good. It tasted just like it. So if you guys want to know how to make that, I'd be more than happy to oblige, or Joe will, or something. <gasps> no! Eats that. Yours eats that too? Men and their tight spots. All right, well, we're gonna make tuna melt. I don't like it, but I love tuna fish, but I like my tuna on toast with egg. Chingo! We don't have no eggs. Anyways, we're, uh, I probably wouldn't have done it on this, because the last time I made it for him, I usually use what I have. If 
I had, um, I like pickles, onions in my tuna when I'm gonna make them melt. If I'm gonna make it as a salad on toast, I, I make it with egg in it. Um, it's a little different. It's a little bit more heat. When it's like this, it's a little run. It's a little drier. So let me just start it. So it's easier, y'all. Okay, don't mind the guys because they're so fine. Ay, mi amor. Okay, um, you want to put the bread on the bu butter on the bread and yeah. you know, show them the bread we're using. Yeah. It's a loaf of like French bread here. Ugh. We're making a hot sandwich, so let me take off the Wi-Fi. Usually, you'd put a, a tuna melt on a on like a. a flat regular sliced bread but we're going with a like a hoagie style french bread so we're just cut off the piece and we're just making sandwich kind of a that. big salad for him versus a smaller um like on a bread i mean ideally he's gonna only eat one sandwich so if he's gonna eat just one sandwich then i want it to be uh, is this so, both huh this is both pat yes. uh, okay uh right now we have just Miracle mayo mix. We make it in a bowl separate like this. We put miracle and mayo together. That's butter. I know, oh. but I'm saying in a bowl like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We mix it up and then we put it in the tuna. Just regular tuna. We don't buy albacorbi or whatever that's called. It's just regular canned tuna. That alone is expensive. That used to be like 65 cents. It's like a dollar 29 now for a little baby can of tuna. Okay, I have white onion putting in there. Uh, put in as much as you like. Make your tuna basically any way you like. I would put hella uh, pickles in it because I do eat pickles like I'm. they're going out of style because homegirl likes it like that. We're going to put cheese on it. Once we get it spread, we're going to put the cheese. Oh, you're grilling the inside? Yeah, on the inside. Since we're doing a hot sandwich, I'm grilling the inside too. Just so the uh, the wet uh, tuna Moisture fish of the yeah, doesn't... Uh, come through the bread and get it mushed So he's it giving up. it like a little um, yeah. Regular crust. toast, no, no butter right now, just toasting. Yep, just regular crusting it up, just plain bread. And it's gonna actually just, it doesn't get uh, like grilled cheesy toasted, it gets crusted toasted, like uh, like a crisp, like a, you grit your knife and you go like that, that's the kind of toasted, that's what it gets, okay? Yes, like, <laughs> you're so stupid, <laughs> that like that. All right, we have onion, white. I put half and half, but I put less of all. If I was just gonna put white onion, I would not put, um, I would put more if I, because I only have, let me say it like this. If I was only using one onion, I'd use white. But since I have both my white and my green, I put them both in it. I just put a little bit of both because I like both of the flavors. We're gonna put tomato in it and we're gonna put some queso in it. So, um, hold on one second. We have some baby cucumbers that we might be able to... You want to open it, Dad? Yeah. I was going to see if that tomato could be cut. Do you think yeah. it's too ripe? No, I think it's fine. Which or, one? This I, one? Yeah, no, no, no. The this other one. one. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's fine. You think so? Okay, oh. wash it. You got to wash it before you do it. All right. Oh. Ay, babe, you scared me. me. You guys, we got Joe a TENS unit for his back and for his knee. So, it, the other night, he fell asleep with the TENS unit on him. He woke up, and that little sticker thing was on his stomach. <laughs> Shut up. Is that not the funniest thing ever? I was cracking up. I'm like, bro, you got up? And I was like, do you know you got a sticker on your stomach? Um, I probably, I like my celery in my chicken salad. I don't know. Do we put celery in our in this? I usually just put pickles and onions in it. Um, I'm a big pickle fan, guys. You guys have seen me go, go ham on it. You guys, I hope your day has been going good. Anybody coming in for the drama community, don't think too much about it, y'all. Don't think too much about it. Okay? Just keep going and doing. You guys, your home life is more important than what's going on on this, on this platform. Nothing on this platform takes away from your children, your kids, your dog, your husband, uh, the show that you love watching at night, whether it be... Um, American Idol or Voices or whatever that's called. Um, there we go. I'm all set on my toes. Thank you, baby, baby, baby. What, are you going to try cutting the that? Yep. All right. Um, I have some pickles or cucumbers. You guys, I have honestly always been like that. I know some of you guys know my history with a couple of creators. Um, but even before that, 
it that it's kind of why it didn't i mean it was kind of mean obviously what i went through but i didn't let it bother me because there's life is too short these people are on here they like just remember like it's your life the sun still sets the moon's gonna come up in a couple hours nothing is worth your sanity you guys nothing watch a good cartoon watch a spongebob if you like it does it taste like the garden of Eve? yeah taste the tomato look at that y'all toast it this is what we we're talking about okay i am gonna spread i'm gonna spread the bottom first because i'm gonna put the cheese you want the butter on the back right yep okay spreading this and i put the tuna before the tomato because i don't want my tomatoes to get completely warm obviously they're going to get a little warm but i mean you also want to be uh i actually should have done with the cheese first yeah i'll do it on the side okay okay hey, here's my thing i want you to i'm going to cut a piece of this hold on i don't want anything wet here okay. here's my top bread and i'm gonna i almost assemble it as two store-bought taste lord Okay. It tastes like a tomato. This is just out of the garden? Out of the garden. What our community this? garden, guys. What did you rate the first one? What did you rate it? Like a, like a three or four. That's just, aroma. Yep. That's and I love tomatoes. Yep. Hmm. Mm, say wow. less. Wow. Say right? less. Mm -hmm. Wow. What a difference. It just tastes like your It's hop. sweet. It it's... tastes like your hose outside, you guys. Oh, my God. That is so good. Okay. You guys, the idea of the cheese is to put it on the closest side of it because i'm going to put tomato which is going to be cold and i'm going to put the tuna so i want my cheese to get a little more melted than not does that make sense here's my cheese Woo! sorry guys <laughs> sorry sorry tuna put as little or as much if you have a lot of people you're trying to feed thin it out man they won't know if you put cheese and everything else in there if it's just you and your hubs thicken it up Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the butter. You want me to use a good one, don't you, cover on? <laughs> I'm gonna put um, yeah, just a couple. So. Yeah. Um, you, it's already warm though. I'll put that. It's okay. Uh, don't use all. all I don't mind. I don't mind. I don't mind. Okay, close it up. I'm gonna put butter. The butter I have. We gonna bring them over here, Dad? Yep. Come on, baby. Come on. Move out of the way. Yeah. You see? All right. Here's the butter, guys. Is that not butter? That's yeah. butter. Okay. Butter. The only thing I did before you guys, we drained the tuna fish and we put the what's it called? Mayo and and. Uh, yeah. Oh, you got to start warming up a cast iron, the small one, uh, so it can. Oops! I put it on. Put it on wrong. Dang it! Sure. <laughs> Hold up! Wait a minute. What's wrong? It has oh. to go sideways. Sideways. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> Sorry. It matters to me. Okay. Remember, if you have any kind of pan in the house, you guys, a cooking pan, anything like that. See the cast iron? Only because it's heavier. Once that's warmed up, it's almost like a panini. That's what we're gonna do with it. Right now, I'm gonna butter it. Butter. Anybody who's coming in for the healthy, go to our other video. We we did keto. We did it. We One did it time. for you guys. One time. <laughs> uh, and when you're with your tomatoes and stuff, just make sure it's lined up, guys. I mean, it's your sandwich, you guys. But I think it's important that it looks pretty. Tuck, tuck them in, tuck them in. It's got tomato, cheese. We're gonna put this once we flip it. And you don't have to do it. You can just flip it. <clears throat> when we smash it, it's going to press the heat. Does that make sense? Um, like right now, it's kind of all the heat's coming out everywhere because it just is. Once yeah. we put this on it, it's going to enclose the heat and it's actually going to warm up your patty, yeah. your t uh, tuna melt. Yeah. Yeah, the... Um, you're going to have heat on both sides Yeah, at the same that's time. what I... The spatula. Plus, you're going to have... Pressure heat on both sides. Pressure, pressure and time equal heat. For all you. All right, ready, guys. Flip. Buffs. 
Go ahead. Let's see. Hit it. You ready? Yep. Yo, oh, that's good. <laughs> and you just let it hang out. And, I mean, that's nice. Yeah. With tuna, it squashes it out a little bit. but Get that little baby cheese that's would, trying to would, run off. We would do this with any kind of hot sandwich. I would. You know. Any kind of sandwich you're going to grill. We used to do paninis. Oh, we had a panini machine. Oh, that's a good oh. Stuff. Here's the good stuff. That's yours. We would do an Italian uh, panini. Oh, my God. It was so good, you guys. Oh, yeah. That's panini. my next that's thing. I want a panini. Panini machine. You guys, once we get a panini made, we're going to make a bunch of them with you guys, and you guys will die. You can make them on that, kind of, just like we're doing. I want a little more, a little more butter. Like you. I'm like, <laughs> yeah, I'll do it. <laughs> Everybody's doing it. I'm going to do it again. Get your pan. Get it hot again. See it? Put it back on the fire. Keep your fire going if you want. Do as you please. You guys, this is what we had for breakfast. I made tortillas because I know we use the burrito ones. But I made tortillas. And then I made potatoes today. Just that's it. We eat a lot of potatoes, don't we, baby? Yeah. I don't mind them. They're hot. They're good. And tortillas. I mean, my favorite is eggs, but we didn't have any, but I would made an egg, put it in the middle, did you, did you, oh, and just, okay, calm down, Ivan, calm down, Jamal, calm down. I get excited, I get excited. My nephew, we, we stayed over there, and uh, my nephew was playing his video game. Man, that kid was, all he kept saying is, he would show me these crazy videos. My nephew's insanity, yo, insanity. Get it? Oh, shoot, I didn't call nobody. None of my family knows I'm live or nothing. <laughs> Poor mom. Oh, mom, you're here. I didn't even tell you guys we were live. How did you know? We're live. Oh, my God. I'm going to have to do the tink with you. How am I going to eat it? Should I make my own little sandwich or do I take a tink of yours? Take a tink of mine. Oh, Dios mío. Por qué? All right, I'm going to start setting up so we can do the tinky with you guys. You need a plate. You guys, I really want to do the... Um, no blue plate. Special uh, plate. What are they called? I tried doing. I did all the dishes. Where's that? I don't know. What are you doing? Um, I want to make the what's it called with you guys? Um, what are they called, Joe? Uh, apple, apple something. The apple, the apple of my eye. No, I'm just kidding. The apple fritters. I was gonna make that tonight, and I was like, ah. I want to make it. I had a craving. You guys, I had a craving, and I made cookies last night instead. Okay, sorry, sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Just, we'll just squish eat it. it back in, y'all. We'll just eat it. <laughs> and it, all it does is give both sides. Oops. It gives both sides a, 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 a what's it crust a firmness. I'll show you guys in a minute. Hold on. A little bit fell out. It's okay. We'll put it back in there. Hold on. Don't cut nothing. No. Nope. Oh, you got a serrated knife? I do. Okay. Turn around, everybody. Oops. Sorry, guys. You guys, I'm going to taste it for you guys. You guys are that important to me. You guys are that important to me. Oh, we can share because I probably won't be eating too much of it, Daddy. <laughs> Lord help me. Wait, let me do roll call. Let me do anything but try it. You guys, it's good. I just we'll have just never had one. Plate, we, I've never had one, so I don't know what the actual flavor is supposed to be. Likes for days. Leslie! Thank you, Mama. Thank you, Liz. Also, thank you. Uh, thank you, Queen K. For your blessing yesterday, Bert's Bud. <laughs> I would too. I know, girl. I want to do the apple fritters, you guys. You want Damn pickles? it! I'm gonna. Annie, mom, mom, how are you, mom? Thank you, Liz. Pickles. Thank you very much, love. Pickles. I love you guys. You guys are the bomb. Pickles. Liz, you're the bad bitch. Thank you for the blessing, Mama. Thank you. Okay, who wants to try that for me? Anybody want to come and try it for me? Let's do it. 
We're gonna take a. So eat. you need something to eat, and drink? Yes. Thank God. <laughs> You're gonna get punched, Joe. <laughs> so did you drink my soda? No, it's right there. You're a good honey, baby. You guys, Your Joe's soda. good. Your soda. Oh, you can have it after I take a sip. You guys ready? Right. I've tuna never melt. had a tuna melt. There it is. Grab it. Here we go. Thank you, Mama. Tink. I love you too. Ooh. Oops. Tuna melt. Tink. Tink. Why do I think it was gonna be different? Mm, I don't know. That's good. You like it? First bunch. They, do we show them? Yeah, we show them. Yeah, that's really good. <laughs> not bad. That's really good. I was not thinking that. Wow, you're gonna have another bite? Mm-mm. It's home. You guys, stop it. But look at how nice and crunchy it is. Queen K, I was just talking about thank you for last yesterday's blessing, Mama. I appreciate it. It's a little blurry. Let's move you. We have the Wi-Fi on, Joe. Is it on? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's on. Maybe it's the uh, camera. You think so? Could be here. Um, Oh, we got everything on the ground. What is it? Ay, my toallitas. Let me get a... Get it. get it, boy. Get it. You guys, our apple fritters are this simple. It's just this and apple. Should we try to do it? Okay, we're going to try to do it. Should we try to do it? I'm nervous. We gotta get them back out of here. Okay. See if that's any better. Okay, you take that over there. Let's take a drink. All right. You guys, we're gonna do the apple fritter right now. We are? Yeah, why not? Joe's always like that. He's like, wait, we are? That's you gotta, good. You gotta deep fry it? Yeah. It's okay. What's up, doggy? Move, move, move. You guys, give me one second. We're gonna do the apple fritter right now, okay? Because I said so. And I run this house. Not just kidding. So I was like, what? Wait, what? You can use a saucepan. I found that saucepan weighs a little bit heavier than a regular pan. Okay, I'm using a Granny Smith because I had to buy the Granny Smith for my dessert. Remember I made that dessert, you guys? That's why I'm using a Granny Smith. You can use, I think a Honeycrisp or a Granny Smith are best because they're a harder apple. Does that make sense, you guys? I, that would be the smarter idea to use. All right, I'm gonna set my things up, you guys. No mise et poire with you guys. Tonight, we're swinging from the, from the ropes or whatever that's called. What do you call that? Swinging from the ropes, right? Mm. What? Swinging from the rafters? Oh yeah, swinging from the rafters. Whatever. He knows what I meant. That's why we're married. He knew mom. He knew my brain. Or the rafters. Swing, uh, whatever. We're, <laughs> we're shooting from the rafters. <laughs> Shooting, shooting for the stars. That's what I'm trying to say. Shooting for the stars. Okay, guys. Aim down. But in moi, while I get my apples. Pero out of my kitchen, mama. Get out of my kitchen, please. We have grannies. Uh, roll call. I believe it's Legs for Days, Belle Belle, Queen K, Liz Lee, uh, Mom. All right, I'm gonna take off this because it was a couple. Why, Why? Mm, I don't like rubber that much. All right. Yeah, I probably should have like soaked them, but I don't know. You, if you have beautiful granny smiths, then you don't have to do this. This girl doesn't have beautiful granny smiths, so I'm doing this. My granny smith was opened a couple days ago. Who's here? Oh, Mama. Yeah. I thought you were saying Marissa. Uh -huh. And I'm keeping the skin on. Oh, I don't know. Maybe I'll take the skin off for my right. My, uh, baby, I'm going to need my. You guys, it's just a packet. I think Jiffy makes it. That's the one I was supposed to use. All I could find was this right, one just... of apple cinnamon. Get going. Okay. Move this it. is the Go. easiest version of. The easy version of. Apple fritters. I'm sure there's another one with homemade dough, we and you let it fried. rise. Huh? We have something on the right to make something to fry it in. Yeah, there's a, a the the oils down there, Daddy, in the in the oven. All right. 
And I'm going to get one of these. Everybody's this side. Okay, guys. I want, what do you guys think? Do I want the apple? I'm trying to remember. I think she. I wanted to make apple fritters, and I was like, oh, my God, this is so easy. They literally used a biscuits of grains, and you take them out, and you pull them apart. So, you know, they're layers. So you pull apart them. Then you, like, cut them like you're cutting them for monkey bread, like into fourths. Then you get your apples, and you kind of, like, squish it all up together. And I just didn't, I don't know if I trusted that or what. I don't know why I trusted this more, but I do trust it more. Uh, so I said, you know what, let me keep, and I wanted to just, you guys, I get through little sweet hankerings at night a lot. Like in the middle of nowhere, I'll be like, oh my God, babe, like last night, I went in the kitchen and he was like, what are you doing? We're literally in the middle of a movie, weren't we, babe? Yeah. And I started making cookie dough and I threw it in the air fryer on the top shelf and it was in 12 minutes. We had a giant cookie and I just cut it in half and said, want a piece of cookie? And he was like, yeah, thanks, babe. I mean, I did like literally made made it. Made it from scratch. The eggs, the two sticks of butter. That's like Toll House one. Two sticks of butter, white sugar, brown sugar, blend it. And then I put the vanilla in it. You guys, I'm telling you. And then in a separate bowl, I got my flour and I put my baking powder, baking soda maybe. And I made it. I don't care. To me, it's worth it. I don't care if it takes me 15 minutes and I was expecting to just stay relaxing on the couch for the whole movie. I'd rather take the time because I like a good... You can pour it in there, Daddy, if you want. In the bowl? Yes, bowl please. Yes, please. I'm cutting them that, that, that size. Does that make sense? Okay. Quick version apple fritters. We're not doing apple fritters with dough show them this, and please. yeast. Yeah, show them one more time. Martha's. Martha White. Yep. And they Apple make cinnamon. Jiffy's also. <laughs> what does it say? Add milk, right? Uh, it says just add milk. All right. And I'm making these about bite much? size. Uh, I'm just going to do it per chunky. It's not. Uh, I'll do it on my own. All right. If that's all I need to add, I'll add it. I'll put a little vanilla on my own people's. I can't even read. I had small. Yeah. Thank you, Liz. Thank you again. I don't remember if I said thank you, but I appreciate it. Command, uh, like Queen K. Thank you, guys. Um, so you guys, me and Liz were talking today, and things are in the work. Things are in the works, and we're kind of excited, aren't we, Liz? Half a cup. Do you want a half a cup, or are you just uh, going to wing it? I'm going to wing it. Because my brain tells me, do as you want. Here, Daddy. Where's my whisk? Um, all right, all right, all right. Okay. There you go. I know Joe would never do this. He does not believe in just like, oh, just do it now. Do it later. No, we'll do it now. Like, he just does it. He wants it to be, like, planned. Well, it's good to do it the way they say, and then then you can, and then you see if you like it, and then if it needs Is to be. Is my whisk in it, Daddy? The little one? Yeah. No? Uh, nope. My Dios. You said you did the dishes. All right. So I guess I didn't do the dishes. You guys, whatever recipe you're following... If you buy the Jiffy one, do the Jiffy. I'm doing this one because, to me, I couldn't find the Jiffy. I looked in every aisle, and I know where Jiffy normally is. So you're basically going to add your... Um... Are you going to eat any more of your sandwich? No, I'm fine. You can eat it. I think it's good. I just don't want it. I'm making this. Okay. okay. You, you want it to be dry. So follow your instructions on your... On your... Um... On the recipe, don't try to wing it because if it says to do it a certain amount, it probably wants you to do it a certain amount. I, oh. I am going to add, you guys, the forbidden flavor. Y'all know what it is. This stuff. A little bit of cinnamon. Nobody get excited because there's nothing to get excited about. It's cinnamon. 
I'm like the worst kitchen channel. I always say I hate cinnamon. The grossest stuff ever. <laughs> okay, it seems like it's a little bit runny. See how it looks like that? But I'm gonna add my apples to it. And then I'll determine, you can add a little bit of flour, you guys. I know that I was gonna add apples to it. It's gonna get a little bit more chunkier. And you're basically gonna put them in, that's it, you guys. You're basically gonna put them in like that. Does that make sense? Like you're gonna clump it into one spoon. And then when you when it comes out, you're gonna have your icing in a bowl or whatever. And then you're just gonna, the glaze, I'm sorry, the glaze, not the icing. Powdered sugar is your friend on this yeah, one. Yeah, the kitchen, go. How many you guys, times that is awful. Why are you guys in my kitchen? Because there's something, there's something. Ugh. Drop, drop. Go, Dobby. Come on, get up. Up, up. Get. Go on, get. Right, Joe? <laughs> go on, get. Sit. You're horrible. Either get up there or sit down. Um, I'm going to do the, do you want to do the powdered sugar for me, baby? Yeah, what do you need? I need powdered sugar powdered sugar in a bowl so that way I can um powdered sugar in a bowl so I can add the milk to it okay I want to use that powdered sugar? these people better not steer me wrong just kidding if they steer me wrong we'll know why because Yvonne didn't measure the milk just kidding it looks pretty good it's all flour it's mostly flour in that mix if you guys want to add a lot of cinnamon go for it you guys oh that's a smart idea baby okay guys step aside with me you want it thicker or no 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 no. just add a little bit of no you want that oh uh, mm. together a little bit better no i think no? it's good you think it's good all right yeah. and i'm We're using at... a tablespoon because i want it to be a little bit on the see like that that's how big i'm going to make mine make where it when more. it goes in there is it ready it's ready Okay, here we go, y'all. Hold your breath. Joe hates me taking chances with you guys, but I like it. I mean, that way, if you guys try it, you guys are like, uh, man, it didn't work. You're like, oh, yeah, mine didn't work either. Here we go. Got it? Ready? Sure. You want me to go down? And that, that's how I do yeah. it. Thank uh, Milltown for the the what's that thing called and then you just drop it in that's it guys yeah. we gotta start getting our this little thing i'm gonna put a couple more so i can flip them yeah and i put granny smith you guys and i have a big tablespoon and i'm dropping it in and i'm gonna start getting my icing ready powdered sugar and i'm putting just be very careful because the powder, the milk, just flies out of there. Sorry, baby. Sorry. The milk flies out of the little, um, out of the half a gallon, and before you know it, it's too runny. And if you don't have any more powdered sugar, you in troubles. Here, you can put it here, Daddy. Is that hot? Yeah. Flippy, flippy, flippy. Uh huh. Oui. Oui. Too hot. Too hot. Too hot. It's okay. Let's take it off and we got more dough. You want me to, we'll put that one aside and we'll do another one. One of them, two more. No? Not too bad. Um, here you go, baby. How's it going? Ooh, it's gonna burn that. All right, you wanna cool it? We'll cool it down for a minute. Yeah, cool Cooling it down, you guys. We got a little excited. Homegirl wanted to do it right now, right now. All right, so Here's now. the dough. And it's literally the packet of apple. So apple cinnamon uh, muffins 
and then you basically dry like just if it has for a half a cup put just before don't pour it in pour get your half a cup and then put it in and then wait and see if it needs a little bit more but then remember you're also going to put apples in it so it's going to also kind of make it a little bit more yeah, thinner whenever you're ready you got it nice and low yes okay it's okay guys first ones the oil was a little hot i'm wipe it off the bottom like that and then i'm dropping it in Trying to make it like more wider. They're a little bit slower cooked, right? Yeah, because the inside will get not get. Yeah, better. there you go. That's not bad. That was not too bad. Mm -mm, just got a little dark. Yeah. Well. All right, we're gonna put it right here, Daddy. Okay. All right. Mm, we'll flip it over. Always oh, a flip. Flip of the cutting board. <laughs> Okay guys, um, I'm going to look for the package so that way we can show you all. Did you put the package somewhere, Betty? Right in the garbage. Right here? Yep. Oh, it's right here. I'm sorry. Um, Not in the garbage yet. On the counter. Apple cinnamon. Just add milk. Then you just do it. It's, this only required a half a cup. I put just a, about a half a cup. I would make it if it does get a little bit if it seems like it's too runny if you try one out and it either gets too runny or if it seems like it's too runny you think mine should be runnier no oh, okay the opposite oh no i don't want to think uh, you got a silver one here just put it in there we go Okay. Put it higher? Yeah. Good. Remember guys, if your heat isn't hot enough, then your uh your thing is gonna get a little more logged than you want it. This one looks like it might be getting done. Mm, it takes a little bit. Yeah? Yeah. This one's just frustrating me over here. Did I make, did I make that one too big, you think? Uh, I don't know. Hard to flip, but... Yeah, that's what I mean, because I don't have a, a straining spoon. Yeah. I want a deep fryer. I want, and then I'll be like, oh, let me just drop these. You want to see it? That, that one's not ready yet, this one? No, it's not ready. I don't think it's ready yet. 315, 310. Should be getting a little I don't bit like this. No, no, that one's falling apart. I know. This one's, this one is a no-go. It's too, I made it too big, you guys. Don't be, don't be showing off. Do we take this one out? Nope. How long are we cooking it for? Flip it over once. Flip it over one more time. Do we have any spoon that has holes? This one. Let's do that, because I don't want to capture the grease. There you go. Ay, ay, ay. Let me take it to the deep end. And then put it in. Okay, we'll put it on the... Syrup, or I mean not syrup. What is that stuff called? Glaze. Glaze. Cause the other one's done. Is it? Mm-hmm. Oh, that flavor's good. Okay, well, that tastes really good. It smells good. I want to do the one now with biscuits, you guys. We're gonna try the next one with biscuits. Biscuits cut up, and then you like squish like all of your apple in it. Plate. Sit tight, everybody. Just kidding. Come on. Oh, da da! Ow, it's hot. Yeah, it'll be a little warm. Everybody, calm down. Kids, get back. 
pretty. It does look pretty. We'll give them that. And we'll move these spoons so we can... Nothing's dirty. All of it's clean. That over there? This over here? Sorry. You're supposed to put it in the cupboard, Joe. The baking powder. Trying to clear up. This is just powdered sugar and uh, milk, guys. And make it as thin or as thick as you want, you guys. If you want a thicker icing. I saw a lady that was just like, dunk into the, uh, like this. Like this. I didn't want to do it like that because it was very hot. All right. Let's get another fork. Go. Nova, out of the. Get out of the kitchen. Get, Go. get, get. Be gone. What do you say? Get on. Ready? Yeah. All right, you, here, you don't want a fork. You're gonna get one? <laughs> okay. Hey. Oops. There you go, guys. Tink. Tink. Right. Tink. Tink. Oops. <laughs> The apples, we use Granny Smith. Mmm. It's actually a good taste. Oh, hot. Okay. Oh, it's very hot. Hey, wrong, Missy. I'm very good. That's the inside of it, guys. It worked out pretty good. See not that? Bad. It's not bad. Mmm. Good. Good for a sweet tooth. Mm hmm. It's pre packaged muffin mix. But I want to try the biscuit one, you guys. I want to try biscuits diced up. This is the one I used. I want to try it with biscuits, like the grands, and you tear them apart. Like you split it in half. And you share bear. Then you get your, like you're doing monkey bread. Then you sprinkle a little bit of flour, you get your apples, and you just kind of like push it all together like so that you're incorporating all the apples. Get your rolling pin and roll it out. And then you just kind of like cut. Oops, sorry. That's okay. Cut down the middle. Hey, Sofa Mama. How are you, babe? We made tuna melts. So eat them. Rewind it. You got to see it. It's super, super good. Um, we just did apple fritters because we just thought we'd do it at all today. But you roll it out after you have your apples incorporated into your dough. Then cut it down the middle into the size that you want. If you want to do them like that size, do them that size. Cut it down the middle. Like almost basically like you're doing um, tic-tac-toe. Do it like that. And then that's the size. It's, it's more of like a dough. We're doing the next one like that, you guys. This was just trying out the recipe. We're going to do another one. Marisa, there's your uncle. Hey, kiddo. Boo -boos. hey, Chasey. What's up? Hi, baby guys. You guys, tomorrow my daughter walks. Tomorrow. She went to see Barbie today. And one of her, they painted their nails pink. And she said, Mom, it was the most amazing movie. She, hey, Southern girl. She said, if I hadn't already gone to school, this movie just, like, it rejuvenates you, like, women are beautiful and strong do you know what as a mother to hear your daughter say that like just to just to be so like feeling so uh excited um i don't know how to describe it but she goes oh i'm just so excited i'm glad i went to see the movie and i'm just excited that i walked tomorrow that i took i watched this movie the night before i'm going to walk and calm down yvonne it was very exciting though you're gonna do it again all right, we're gonna keep trying. You guys, if you got anybody wants to get out of here, we did turkey, we did tuna melts, and we did, um, and we did, um, we did tuna melts, and we did apple fritters. You guys, I'm gonna get the apple. I'm gonna get some uh, biscuit dough, like Grand's biscuits, and we're gonna do it again. Okay, I want to try two different ways, so that way, if you have the Grand's in your uh, in your fridge, we're gonna learn it. If you're not able to buy the box of two ninety nine grams, we're gonna buy one of these for a dollar fifty or dollar twenty five. We have options. That's what I want. 
I love you, beautiful. What did you say about this weekend, mama? Come get us this weekend. Yeah, we will. We'll come get you, baby. Marissa and Chase want to come. Chase, are you coming too? Yes, I'd love to have my beautiful little kids. Chase, did you just put your dog as your picture? Oh my God, Chase, I'm going to punch you. <laughs> he did put, he put Poppy as his picture. I love you guys. I love you, Marissa. Anybody coming in, those are my niece and nephew. They have wrenches. They don't know how to use them, but they're my niece and nephew. And they get a wrench from Aunt Bonnie because they're my babies. But they don't even, my mom doesn't know what to do with her wrench either. But mom goes, how come my name's not blue? I'm like, oh, you, hi, Thea. Yeah, no, we, we made apple, apple fritters, Thea. Not apple turnovers. I can make those for you and my mom. She wants to make apple turnovers too. I'll make apple turnovers for you. We're experimenting. I love doing this with you guys. I think it's a lot of fun. How are they looking, Daddy? They're looking. Yeah, it helps when the grease is very hot. Not very hot, ready. Let me just say that, ready. Because if the hot, the grease isn't, ooh, why is that all fluffy? Uh -huh. You guys, don't forget, uh, the link is for my Cash App, Venmo, PayPal, and for my Zelle. Uh, thank you, everybody who has given me and blessed me. I appreciate it. If you're able to bless me with the Cash App, if you're able to bless me, in any way, thank you very much, Birch Bunch. The link goes to our Facebook page. The link goes to our, I think it's Instagram. He had, my son put all of them on there. Yes, Thea, I'm gonna do it for you. Um, anyways, that's my Thea. There's only a matter of time before she starts wanting a wrench too. All my family members want a wrench, huh, Marissa? <laughs> I love them so much. Thank you for coming in. Anybody that leaves, thank you for coming in. Soflo Mama, Thea. I don't even know. Uh, Burke's Bunch, Bell Bell, The Wrong Messy. I love tuna mouths. I'm going to take these back to me and my grandma. Oh, I love you. Thank you, babe. Thank you, Soflo Mama. That means a lot. It really does. You guys, and this is just anybody who's going to be leaving from here. My, my final words to you guys are... Yeah, I don't want to burn the my final words to you who's ever leaving whoever's coming in the weight of this YouTube streets right now is very heavy there's a lot of things that people are just devastated on just remember everybody has everybody I just don't want to read the plate see it um, everybody has reasons that they get on the app and a lot of the reasons is because they just want a release and an exit and um when you stop being able to go on to the into uh the app to either get recipes to catch up with your girlfriends because a lot of times that's why people get on the app they get on there to catch up with their friends i know when i go into charlotte's i'm gonna run into burke's bunch and i'm gonna run into freckle face and i'm gonna run into the wrong missy like that's why a lot of people do it i used to go into a certain chat that literally was that's when I saw the girls that are in here now, uh, uh, Queen and Milltown and Liz, like that's the, when I saw them. I don't have their phone numbers to talk to them. So a lot of people go on to the app to release and hang out. Just don't, don't think so much about the stuff that's going on. Um, just don't, it's because it's, it's your, it's your peace of mind. Like people are not taking care of themselves enough. It's, just it's not it, it makes people sad that things don't happen the way they you guys thought they were supposed to happen but don't give up on you guys first who's gonna take care of you if you're like worrying about other stuff take care of you okay okay joe joe's got us ready we're going for number two y'all please don't tell those people that send me those mean messages about being fat mm -hmm. and joe deserves a better woman they can kiss my ass just kidding let me tear it apart Ooh, Joe, stop, Joe. He's trying to make me look not good. Stop, look at that, you guys. My bad. Tink. Those are the little cin uh, apple cinnamon, like those little brown things, are the apple cinnamon of it all. Ooh, I think I will. 
Tink. Thank you, Burks. Oh my God, that's good. Oh, mm-hmm. That's really, that's really good, Not you guys. Bad. Not bad. Apple fritter me up, baby. I'll try. Mm. I want to try a recipe that I found too. Mmm. Of apple fritters? Mm hmm With dough? Mm hmm With yeast? I don't know. I don't, it's been a long time since I've seen it. Don't try to come for my recipe, bro. I just remember it. I'm trying to make me look like I don't have a good recipe. <laughs> it looks good, you guys. If you have Jiffy, use Jiffy. If you guys have Anna Martha or Martha Ann, I had what we found at the store, and I go, I'm buying this, and I'm buying it. I'm making it with the people. Um, I think that's it for the weekend, you guys. We'll see you guys on Monday or Tuesday, one of the days. Um, you guys, we're working on something. I'll tell you a little bit about it. We want to do... Liz, are you in here? Share your bear. They look good, right? We want to have a girls' night Friday night. And what it would be would be like we have topics non-YouTube. Non-YouTube. There's nothing wrong with YouTube. But we're not going to discuss anything about anybody in Georgia. We're not going to discuss anything about anybody in different uh, social gatherings, that, anything like that. Nothing about YouTube. We're doing, um, we're going to do, um, go. we're going to do, um, we want to do uh, a format. Like one of them is going to be like, everybody's going to be just kind of giving, like one thing, one of them is a topic like, would my, my, are we, my girlfriend is inviting me to her, her part, her wedding. She's asking everybody to. Uh, not bring kids like should I be offended or what do you think so everybody then we're gonna have a, a, like five people on panel and we have a couple of people that we want to do but everybody gets their point of view so that's kind of gonna be a Friday night POV point of view and each Friday night it's gonna be two hours long but we're gonna do just talking about hey we're going on vacation for this weekend does any or next weekend whatever but we want to start doing like, hey, I think uh, Days In has a, a, a weekend getaway and blah, 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 blah. And just kind of chatting with people. That's going to be like a 15 or 20 minute segment because kind of catching up with, like, say, Liz knows of something that there's a special of. Um, so me and Liz were kind of talking. But then there's going to be also a segment about, like, guy stuff, girl stuff. Like, my boyfriend wants to go out with his guy friends. Uh, is, do you think I should be bothered if one of them is going to bring his his girlfriend? Or do you think I'd be cool with it? Like, just topics. Non-YouTube. Like, Liz is very... Like, we're different ages. That's what I want to say. Like, there's... I'm 50 years old, even though I don't look like it. Uh, uh, just kidding. I'm older, but just generational. So, when people come in, maybe somebody's going to relate to what Liz is saying more than what they're going to relate to what I'm saying. Um, and then just the generation differences, I might think one thing, and I mean, I need, just need Liz's to help with the stream yard so that way we can go up on panel. Doesn't that sound so cool? It's going to be cool. Okay, Queen's going to be one, me, Queen, Liz. we got to ask a couple more people. We'll have a Thursday night weta night. No, I'm just kidding, you guys. Does anybody know what that is? You're not old, Burks. Um, we want to do... Like, um, can men and women be platonic friends? Um, and then if so, if they've been friends since high school, but your friend tells you that they don't approve of the guy you're dating, and you've been best friends with this guy, this opposite sex since high school, then you're now through your 30s, and this person's now been your friend for 20 plus years. Do you respect that your best friend knows and has the vibe as it's not a good person? Or, <laughs> I'm gonna slap you, Liz. Yes, yes, yes. 
Yes, it's going to be a different perspective. It makes everybody think because I might go, yeah, why wouldn't it be? A, why would it be a problem? But then if I hear Liz describe it, Joe finishing out the apple fritters. <laughs> Madre, como esta? Yeah. We had better left. Um, he just wanted to make me look bad. I know, Joe. Um, so it, when Liz, oh shit, Joe. <laughs> They're good. Joe's good. Y'all stop it, Joe. We're good. My God. So once Liz describes it and her view on it, maybe I'll see it completely different. So that's why it's gonna be Friday night, ladies night POV. Like um, our ladies night point of view. And we're gonna just do nothing YouTube related, nothing. We're not gonna talk about any YouTube topics, none. We don't, not that we don't care about them, but we want people to be able to come in on a Friday night and not stress about the shit that's going on on the streets. Not care that there's somebody backstab somebody else or somebody that done this and that and blah, 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 blah. we just want to get together and everybody laugh don't be sorry freckle face you good girl um so that's what our plan is i need liz's help because she's she's a mastermind shit. Shit. oh shit <laughs> If you're not working, I love the way you said it. I'm not behind bars. Who knows? Bring your drinks. You can be at the bar while she's behind bars. Just kidding. Just kidding. Nobody, I don't know if anybody knows. Uh, I know what she's talking about. But she goes behind bars. <laughs> you guys, we're going to have a blast. We really, really are. I'm really excited. Everybody's, you know why? Because everybody's like, Kind of got the same mentality, the per same personality. We're all just hella chill. Like, like we're just badasses. Like, I mean, we are. But, I mean, we're going to be all hanging out together. Everybody get a drink. If you want to have a glass of wine, if you want to have your 420 dabbed up and ready to go, we're just going to chill and relax. And that's what our plan is. There's not, there, that's the whole thing is. I didn't want, the way we don't talk drama in our chats right now, in here, nobody talks about it. And I want it to be like that on the Friday nights when we do the ladies' night. I don't want anybody to go, oh, my God, who's on panel? Who's on? Like, it's not going to be drama at all. My girls come in, and they are amazing women. And I'm blessed to call them my friends. I have amazing friends. I've made great friends. I know that everybody says, I know that a lot of people say that YouTube is, like, full of this, just, like, whatever. But I've made great, great, great friends. I have been friends with Liz for a long time. I have been friends with Marissa for a long time. Um, I'm blessed. I'm so blessed because they're just ride. They ride for me. I mean, hella ride for me, and I love that. Um, I to me, you could literally loyalty to me is at the top. I don't even care. You could hit my car. You could probably rob from my house. But if you are loyal to me, I, I mean, I, loyalty go, it goes a long ways with me. I am just a diehard for loyalty. Um, so anyways, I said all that to say it's coming in a couple Fridays. We're going to get all the stuff together. Liz is like the mastermind of this all shit. So we need her to walk me through the stream yards to connect it. So that way we have the bomb platform and I can drop a link in all the stream yards. Everybody's going to come up on panel. Then everybody's going to come in and whatever we talk about, y'all share your opinions. We're going to be sh sharing our opinions. It's going to be a badass night. Okay. I said all that to say, have a good night. We'll see you guys. Liz, thank you again. Anybody's able to bless Cash App, PayPal, Venmo, Zelle. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the Zelle that we got. I appreciate it. Um, and please know that it was the receipt was deleted. Didn't even think twice about the names or on anything like that any names we get for the cash app venmos or anything your name associated we delete it i delete it anyways i don't care what the names are on attached to it it doesn't it, it just doesn't it doesn't matter to me i delete it i don't want to know what your name is because to me you're just freckle face um <laughs> liz <laughs> can someone
some can one of these mods do something do something jeez just stop doing you can stop deleting stop blocking just stop blocking people okay stop blocking people <laughs> Are you gonna block it? Are you gonna delete anything? Or are you just gonna let them keep talking shit? You just let them say this shit. Do something. <laughs> You're like, didn't you just tell me not to do anything? Hi, Stargazer. <laughs> I feel like. <laughs> Give me my money back, bitch. <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna get in trouble. This dude's really gonna come look for me. I said, oh my God, I'm so scared. And Joe's like, why are you scared? I'm like, Joe, I don't want somebody to come find my ass. And then Joe's like, I ain't afraid of shit. And I was like, okay, fine. Joe's not afraid. I love my Liz. I ain't letting nobody touch my girl. Hell no. Not today, Satan. I love you guys. Be blessed. I'll see you guys on Monday. I'll probably be on the streets around around the streets but we'll be back on monday or tuesday maybe we'll go live over the weekend i want to go live with you guys oh you guys i want to do taste of <laughs> i'm gonna punch you Liz. i love you so much <laughs> thank you for your blessing thank you thank you um i want to do um take you guys with us and then we order whatever the person in front of us orders um, I was seeing this person and I was like, oh, that's not bad. And Joe's like, yeah, but what if they order like two black coffees? Are you going to drink it? And I'm like, I mean, I might, but, but well, this is the thing. We're going to go to Dutch Bros. We're going to go to Dutch Bros to make sure that I like this stuff. Because I like pretty much everything at Dutch Bros. Um, but yeah, we're going to go to Dutch Bros. And then um, like Starbucks, there's too many coffee things that I don't eat. But Dutch Bros, and one just moved in right down the road. So we want to do that maybe over the weekend. Um, I want to take you guys to Central Market or Whole Foods, one of them. And then you guys kind of pick out different things. We're going to show you guys them. And then you guys tell us what to pick. And then we'll, like, set up our little camera. And then you, we're going to try the things. So I was like, what if they have us try, like, couscous and shit? And I was like, bro, we're trying the couscous then. We're not going to tell them we're going to do it. We're going to do it. Now, Liz. Can you get the frick off and do something with your ass? Dude, I have a hard time holding my tongue. I'll, I'll text you. I'll text you, mama. I love you. I love all my party people. No commander tonight. I'm not, No Marissa tonight. Thank you, Burks Bunch. Thank you, Sherry Bear. Thank you, Leslie. Queen K, Freckle Face, Madre. I love you guys so much. You guys, if you're not going to block anybody, I'll just take the damn wrenches. Taking all the wrenches. That's it. I'm taking the damn wrenches. Nobody's getting wrenches anymore. That's it. I'm taking the wrenches, okay? I don't know if I can trust. I don't know if I can trust you guys. Uh, Y'all are just, like, fucking with me or some shit. I feel it. I feel it. I'm taking everybody's wrenches. <laughs> Dude, dude, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put myself in some hot ass water. I love you guys. Nobody's gonna lose their wrenches. Okay, I'm just lying. That's just a character. Just kidding. Shit, I'm gonna stop. That's just a character. Nobody's gonna lose their wrenches. <laughs> I'm just gonna stop. I love you. Bye, y'all. Bye. <laughs> oh shoot, I can't. I love you guys. <laughs>